Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel Code for Kids. How are you all? How was your day? I hope you are enjoying your day. So in this video, we will create one mini project. So this mini project is all about your some game. So this is our cricket game. So what I will do first, I will run this project. I will show you the output here. So here you will get your game name. So our game name is the Jig game. So we need to press S for start. Okay. After that we need to just press the S button to start and you have to press the F space bar. Okay. So here you will get hit or out like that. Miss as you can see. So again, we need to press S for the start. We need to press the S space button. Okay. So this game is all about a cricket match. So first thing I will explain you what you will require here. So first we will require some backdrop. So as you can see, we need to add our first backdrop, which is a black screen. Then we have this cricket ground. Third, we have like instruction, like uh, we need to press S to the play, press I for instruction, press T for difficulty. Then we have a next one instruction, press space to hit the ball. If you miss, you are out. Once you have three out, you lose. Press M to go to the menu and press S to start. Then we have our next backdrop, which is difficulty. One is for easy, two is for medium and Three is for hard. Now again, so this all are the instruction we have to add as a backdrop. Okay. So all this backdrop we need to add total five backdrop we have. Now I will explain you our next part which is sprite. So first we need to add this sprite. So this is our first sprite. For this sprite, we have a second costume. Like we are hitting the ball as you can see. Then we have our hitting bar. Okay, means we need to add this hitting bar. After that, we have one bar as you can see here on this line. Then we have home run. We have check. We have games. We have this as a next player because all these things we will get in our difficulty level and we have this ball so this all are the sprite we need to add so first one is our hitter baseball then hitting bar then bar then we have our home run then we have a check we have a game then we have a pitcher and baseball okay so this all sprite we need here now we will start from hitter baseball so over here the main thing is we like a once we will press the s we want to start the game okay and uh, now we will see this one by one so first we will start from here so when s keys press so we need to go to one position. Miss this position we want. And then we want to show this hitter baseball. Now, once we will receive the great hit, what will happen? We need to play a sound which is heard. And we need to wait for one second. It will say great hit, home run, and then it will broadcast home run. Now we will see the next one. When S key is pressed, we have to just wait. What will happen if your out is 3? So we need to go to the variable. We will create a variable which is out. So if your out is 3, we need to broadcast game over because we want to over the game. It will say game over. Press S to restart. And it will stop all the things. Okay. Then what is the next part? When flag is clicked. So initially we want to hide this. After some 
time we want to show all this thing because initially we want our instructions. Now we have a three thing. When we will receive the miss, when we will receive the hit and when we will receive the poor hit. So for this three what we want to do. Okay. So when we will receive the miss, it will start one sound. It will say hit, it will say out. We need to broadcast out. Now when we will receive the hit, what will happen? It will wait for a second. It will say hit. It will say home run. Now when we will receive the poor hit, it will say miss and it will say out. Here also we need to broadcast out. So this is our next part we have to do here. Okay. Now we will see the last one for our hitter base like again when flag is clicked so we want to go to the front layer because we want to show this now once space bar is pressed so what will happen we want to switch the costume now as you can see if i will press the space bar we are able to switch the costume right okay and when we will receive the game over, so we have to stop other script in the sprite. So this is the part we have to do. Okay. Then when D key is pressed, we want to again show. When M key is pressed, we want to hide because that is for our menu. When I key is pressed, we want to hide because I is for your instruction. Okay. So this is our header baseball we need to complete this okay now we will see the hitting bar for hitting bar what we want when s key is pressed s means your start we need to go to this position we want to show and initially when flag is clicked so we want to hide this right because when flag is clicked so we want all the instruction first now we will see for the bar. This is your bar. It is picking the random value. Now when S key is pressed, we need to go to this position. We want to show. Now in the forever, we want to glide for your difficulty level. See, we need to create a variable which is difficulty and we have to glide. Glide means you need to move from one place to another. Again, when flag is clicked, we want to hide and we have to come to the front layer. When we will receive the game over, again, we want to stop all the script in the sprite. Okay. Now, when we will receive the OK hit, this is the most important part. What will happen? It will pick a random value or see. We need to start from 1, then pick random 1, 2, 2, then pick random 1, 2, 3, then 4, then 5, then 6. We need to pick 6 value. This is very easy. Means how you will take this, you have to take your OR condition. Go to the operator, take your OR. Okay. Over here, we need to take our equals to, which is this one. And here we need to add our random, which is pick random. Like this. Okay. So we have to add like this. So here we will broadcast miss or hit. And again, if we will press our S key. So S is for start. Now, what will happen if we will touch to this green color? Okay. So, if we will press the green color, what will happen? It will broadcast great heat. If we will press this yellow color, it will broadcast okay heat. If we will press the red color, it will broadcast poor heat. 
okay so this is our bar part this is very easy you have to complete this okay now we will see our home run home run is very easy when flag is clicked we want to hide and once we will receive the home run so we want to show that it has to be wait for some second then we will hide okay now we will see the jack part so for the jack what we have here so when s key is pressed means once we will press the s key we want to hide that when flag is clicked we want to show that we want to set our coast effect means we want to show the color so we want to only repeat this five time like our change the color okay so this is our check part now we have game so for the game what we need to do same thing what we did for the check exact thing you need to copy here okay now we will see for the picture picture is like when flag is clicked we want to hide when we will press the s means when we will start the game then we have to show this then we have our baseball so the baseball is very important here when flag is clicked we want to hide this but when we will press the s key we want to go to one random position and it will set the size of your ball now once we will press the space key it will repeat because it want to change the size okay initially we have a 10 percent size now it has to be wait until your x position is 131 means your ball is little bit here so we have to wait that much and then again it will go to that position like this see see like this okay yeah so you need to complete this baseball also and for the baseball once we will press the d d is for your description so we need to go to that particular position when we will receive the home run we need to glide that glide means from one position to another we want our bulk uh, ball come from one position to another when m key is pressed we want to hide when space key is pressed we need to glide this see we need to glide the ball like this and when we will receive the out so again we need to go to our original position for the ball and when I key is pressed we want to hide this so see this project is very easy here we have a concept like we need to press the space bar what will happen your ball will come based on our random value either we can hit the ball we can drop the ball like that so this all script part we need to complete then we will see for the broadcast our backdrop in the backdrop what we have so first we have to wait for seven seconds then we will switch to basketball field it will broadcast start here what will happen once you will press your dds for description so according to your backdrop you have to change that same for i instruction same when we will receive the start from here it has to be switched to backdrop to the menu once we will receive the out it will change out by one change the variable and the most important part how you will get this you need to just add an extension add your music from here you can select any music okay we can add any music from our choice see this music you have to add by yourself and when is one key is pressed we have to set our difficulty level to two when two keys pressed we want to set difficulty level to one when three keys pressed we want to set our difficulty to 0 0.5 so this is our backdrop part so again uh, we will see this is our hitter 
then we have a hitting bar then we have our bar then we have our home run then we have the check we have the game we have our picture then ball so everything you have to complete even if you want you can do some variations here okay so and what you need to do i will give you this link in the description box you can just check out that and you have to also create the same project you have to share your project link with me how you will share that in the comment section you can just mention your project link so i will see what you did and based on that i will give you some suggestions also okay so thank you so much for watching this video please like share and subscribe our channel and press the bell icon if you want more latest updates so thank you so much have a great day thank you bye bye take care